why did you choose to use Anthropocene as a concept to frame this book? Well, the Anthropocene is a concept that's gained a lot of traction in academic debate in recent years. It describes a new era in planetary history when humanity as a global collective has gained this immense uh, destructive capacity to uh, disrupt the Earth's ecological processes. And we ask in this book, how does this new sort of Anthropocene condition or proposition redirect security thinking and practice in the years to come? So Malin, how is this book linked to the Stockholm Plus 50 celebrations that will happen next year? The Stockholm Conference held in 1972 is recognized as a landmark event in global environmental politics. And in this book, we both celebrate the achievements made since then in global environmental politics, law and institution building, but at the same time, put emphasis on the challenges that remain in global and security politics. And one can all, almost recognize or see the Anthropocene concept as put emphasis on that we are today living in a world which the Stockholm Conference helped to avoid. So Malin, what message would you like to send to those who are crafting the agenda for the Stockholm Plus 50 celebrations next year? In times when we see that we have all these kind of environmental insecurities and inequalities across the globe, we would like to send rather than a message that we need more of a cooperation, more solidarity and care across generation and also species. And we hope that this book can help to navigate towards that kind of thinking. Mm.